Nearly 5,000 acres of the Heil Valley Ranch in Boulder, Bur Boulder County burned in last year's Cowwood fire. That land's going to recover with time and more quickly with human help. Heil Valley Ranch is one of our most popular open space areas in North Boulder County near Lyons. And it was the location of uh, about half of the Calwood fire. So our project right now is to try and stabilize the slopes and prevent erosion from happening in the monsoons. We really have a lot of work ahead of us to stabilize the soils. And it's going to mean a lot of contractors in here. It's going to mean helicopters flying and mulch dropping from the helicopters. Using helicopters is about the only way to access a lot of this terrain since it's pretty steep and rugged. Most of these trees are hazard trees that have been removed from along our roads and trails. It's kind of a nice closed loop here that we can remove trees that are hazard, produce these wood shreds, and then we can then put on the slopes for uh, hill slope stabilization. We have targeted 1,500 acres for aerial mulching. He's got to swing wide to gain enough altitude to get up to the top of the slope. We're doing about five tons an acre, so it's a lot of helicopter trips. It's really critical to get some cover on the slopes to prevent erosion, debris flows, flooding. Um, it's, the research has shown it's one of the single best things you can do in that critical first and second year after post-fire. Having the helicopters for the aerial for the for the immediate fire response and the defense, and then now for the recovery as well. Yeah, it points to how critical this resource is, this aerial resource. And there it goes. We are doing some fire recovery seeding today. And we're kind of entering into um, the burn area of these slopes now try and stabilize the slopes where it burned really hot and a lot of regrowth is not happening. The trees are completely torched and when it gets to that point, that becomes really uh, more devastating. The soils, they lose a lot of their um, organic matter. Diversity is resiliency, really. Um, and that holds true in a lot of facets of society, but it also holds true in um, our ecosystems too. If you have a diverse landscape, you then will have a diverse wildlife population and suites of populations that helps to safeguard from different uh, natural disasters. Go and light on the seed. Fire is an integral part of our ecosystem. And here in the Front Range, we've suppressed fire for the last 140 years. And so we have forests that are overgrown, that aren't used to fire, and that are unhealthy. You know, we certainly cannot control Mother Nature by any means, but I think the more that we try to learn from Mother Nature and work with Mother Nature, the more successful we'll be at mitigating um, some damaging impacts from large-scale natural disasters, as well as stewarding these lands as best as possible. Mm -hmm.